Hello and welcome back to Downhill Smooth Tarmac and a cheeky little extra technical episode. In our previous video, you may well have seen this GT gravel build go together really rather nicely. However, there's always a however with these kind of bikes, two problems have presented themselves. Before you all start shouting, I know V-brakes, road levers, wrong pull ratio. Yeah, you're right. However, these do work. And they work all right, but I just don't like the feel. So I thought that'd be a great excuse to try out one of those weird little things you find on the internet, and that is a problem solver. So what is a problem solver? Well, a problem solver is a little device like this basically going to help us to convert road brake levers to V-brake pull. Because at the moment, although they work, they are a little on the spongy side and this is going to correct that. These cost about £15 off Amazon because these are knockoff ones. Um, genuine problem solvers, travel agents as they're called. They're about £30 each. I dare say they might be machined a touch better than these, but for what we want to do, these are going to do the trick. So let's get in close Let's strip it down, let's put one of these in and see if it makes a difference. Okay, so before the problem solver is installed, this is the kind of throw we're looking at. We can pull that lever in and just about touch the bar, which is no good for the drops. Up high, it's a bit better, there is feel. Let's see if these do the trick. Going in. Up to there. Two o'clock. Threading through. It's tiny. Let's just see how we get on. Yeah, come to think of it, we don't really need an inline adjuster if we've got an adjuster down there. So let's try that. So at this point, actually, you do need an inline adjuster. With problem solvers, the barrel adjuster on the problem solver is actually to adjust the angle that the cables come out. So at this point, I've gone for brand new cables. I'll be honest, if you're gonna fit these, start with a fresh cable. It makes the world of difference. With it being so much longer, it's actually easier to work on and get the right ratio. Because you've gotta get the cable to come through into the second pulley at the two o'clock position or as close as. With them in place and working, you can see straight away the lever feel is way, way better. So let's take a quick close up. There you go, you can see you need to get that cable to come out at the top, the sort of one o'clock, two o'clock position there. And without further ado, or oh, crappery, it's back break time. Two, one, snip it! Snip it. Back brake is pretty much the same as the front. I will be honest, second time felt so much easier than doing the front one. Again, don't forget that angle. You want that cable coming into the big pulley at the back, one o'clock, two o'clock position, otherwise you're not gonna get 
the throw that you need. Use the barrel adjuster on the top to make minor adjustments either way. With a quick spin, that back brake is now done and it's on to that cheeky derailleur. So the other thing I want to change on this is front derailleur. It's rubbish. It's not working. It doesn't fit with that rubber block and it keeps dropping the chain. So I'm going to go a little bit curveball. I'm going to find something that fits better. And I'll be honest, I don't care what it is as long as it works. So I'm going to get the chain out of the way first. I think it might even end up being camp pack. No idea. This is coming off. Get the cable out. There you go. On the line. Cam pack. See if this fits. Oh, I've just adjusted the top limit. So I'm just going to put this back in and let's see if we get some. Do the same thing. There's no ratio to worry about. Let's see if I'm right. Okay, so camp bag didn't work. So I'm gonna try one more triple. A nice allevio. Is there such a thing as a nice allevio? <laughs> I think it's allevio, something like that. Pulling the chain off the mug. Do the limits. Should probably check the limit screws on that because they're seated. Right. For the fifth time is the charm. Early XT. Put the cable on, I've tightened it up. I think this might be a winner. Double check that's tight enough. Here we go. Oh, mama mia. No adjustment required. That is a beautiful thing. Yes! Now it works perfectly, really, really good. We've got nice solid feeling brakes. We've got a front derailleur that works far better than the original method. The bike is now just gonna perform faultlessly. I can feel it, it's brilliant. I'm gonna have to wrap it up because it's late at night and shops is gonna be after me. So, I hope your next ride is down here with smooth tarmac. Keep your wheels spinning, keep your rubber on the road. Most of all, keep the knobblies on the trail. Be safe, look out for each other. Second minute to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video, but most importantly, go ride your bike. Until next time.